President Biden in the last hour toughened up COVID-19 vaccine requirements for federal workers and contractors and for private companies with more than 100 workers. The Delta variant strain of the coronavirus killing thousands of people each week and jeopardizing this nation's economic recovery. In fact, Johns Hopkins now reports there are more than 40.5 million confirmed cases in the U.S. The death toll from the virus, now more than 653,500 Americans. As for the latest positivity rates, it is 3.606% in New York, 8.02% in New Jersey, and 2.93% in Connecticut. Lots to unpack here. I would just reporter Jim Dolan, live on the Upper West Side, with the president's new plan of action. Jim. Well, Bill, the president started his speech today by calling out those who refuse to get vaccinated, saying they are endangering themselves and the economy and the nation's health care system. And he ordered 100 million workers in government and private businesses to either get vaccinated or submit to weekly testing, saying it's time to protect the vaccinated Americans from those who refuse. The president's new plan requires strict new COVID guidelines for more than 100 million federal and private business workers across the country. Get vaccinated or submit to weekly testing. The Department of Labor is developing an emergency rule to require all employers with 100 or more employees that together employ over 80 million workers to ensure their workforces are fully vaccinated or show a negative test at least once a week. The new rules require all federal executive branch workers to be vaccinated and all contractors with the federal government to mandate vaccinations for their workers. And there is this. The new plan will require all businesses of 100 employees or more to require vaccinations or weekly testing for all employees. Altogether, 100 million workers are subject to the new plan. We're going to protect vaccinated workers from unvaccinated co-workers. We're going to reduce the spread of COVID-19 by increasing the share of the workforce that is vaccinated in businesses all across America. COVID, of course, continues to surge across the nation, worse in states with low vaccination rates. Just 62% of Americans eligible are fully vaccinated, and so confirmed cases of the virus have shot up to around 140,000 every day in America, with 1,000 Americans dying from COVID each day, according to the CDC. What more do you need to see? We've made vaccinations free, safe, and convenient. The vaccine is FDA approval. Over 200 million Americans have gotten at least one shot. We've been patient, but our patience is wearing thin, and your refusal has cost all of us. We use that 100 million worker uh, figure. Of course, many of those people are already vaccinated. The, the president is focusing on those who refuse to get vaccinated. And for those businesses that refuse to enforce that vaccine mandate, $14,000 fines. Reporting live from the Upper West Side, Jim Dolan, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.